Hi, I'm Gavin Rooney from Volvo Panta Oceana. I'm the Regional Applications Engineer for uh, Volvo Panta Oceana. In my job role, I actually uh, work with all the boat builders with the development of their vessels to take the new uh, IPS system that we've developed in the last five years. The IPS system actually stands for Inboard Performance System. What we've developed at Volvo Panta is a, a pod that actually creates the rudder, the exhaust system and the propulsion system all in one. So it allows us to develop a boat and bring all the engine and machinery back towards the transom, which giving the boat builders more volume in their boats for their customers. Now the customers are getting full staterooms, etc. In our testing early on in developing IPS1, we found that there was a certain position under the hull, actual boat hull, that the most efficient clear water was, uh, was available to gain the most thrust out of a propeller and by having a parallel to the keel line thrust system which is with the forward facing propellers we've gained up to 30 percent in some vessels uh, better fuel efficiency we've actually created a boat that has more volume better fuel efficiency and a higher normal top end speed since 2008 we've been reducing 15 million litres of diesel into the environment from our engines due to the new IPS system in Australia, we're lucky enough to have some of the biggest boat builders in the country using this new system. Maritimo, Riviera, Palm Beach, Noosa Cat. Many questions get brought forward to us. Forward facing propellers, what happens if we hit something under the water? Well, simple thing is you could break it. Um, but what we have done to create a bigger, higher safety environment around this vessel is the d drive has been designed to shear in some situations. So in saying that, if you hit something, it will shear the lower section of the drive off, but without damaging the actual integrity of the hull. So there's not going to be any water emerging into the boat. In the old conventional shaft, there was always a high risk. If you did take an impact, you were bending the prop, actually turning back in through the boat, and it would cut its, a hot, its hole for itself to find the water inside. So we've developed a system that is actually safe to the boat builder more than the conventional shaft drive as well. I think we've got the product right. If we work with the boat builder, we get a very good outcome for the customer and the customer's going to benefit in a lot of ways.